Some news just coming in. This has got to do with the Gyan Bapi case that is going to resume in the Varanasi District Court on Monday. Well, after the summer vacation, the hearing of the Gyan Bapi campus case is starting from tomorrow in the district judge's court. In the court of the district judge, Ajay Krishna Vishwesh Anjuman Inte Zamyan, Mazajit Committee is continuously presenting its side, which is presenting its side on the appeals given by the Hindu side. So far, the Muslim side has given its arguments on about 33 points, while the objections on the remaining 23 points will be given tomorrow. It might take two or three more days. I'm going to go across to Anisha Mathur. Which are the objections on the remaining 23 points? Anisha, take us through these details, even as the matters hearing essentially resumes from tomorrow onwards. Well, yes, Neha. In, on 30th of May was the last hearing in this matter, after which the courts had closed for summer vacation and tomorrow, that is the 4th of June, the Varanasi court, the district judge court will resume the hearing. Uh, for the Muslim side, advocate uh, Abhinath has been giving his uh, the arguments of, uh, on behalf of the uh, Anjuman in Tazamiya Masjid Committee. There, what the major point of the arguments of the committee is that these petitions filed by Hindu petitioners seeking right to worship in the Shringar Gauri Mandir is in fact barred under the Places of Worship Act. That is the basic argument that they have raised, saying that uh, the continuous, uh, continuous usage of the temple as well as the masjid, it's uh, after independence and after the 1991 Act, shows that both have been at the same place and because the petitions filed by the Hindu parties have called for removal of the masjid, those petitions are not maintainable. That is what the Muslim side has been arguing. On the Hindu side, of course, the arguments have not yet begun. The Muslim side is at the moment presenting its side of the arguments. We are expecting that uh, in the next couple of days, the Muslim side will conclude its arguments and then the Hindu side will ha uh, get a chance to put their arguments across. The petitions, remember, there are about nine petitions that were moved in the uh, Varanasi court on the question of access to the te uh, access to the Shringar Gauri temple, restoration of the tem tem temple and removal of what they ca call as an encroachment of the masjid. They are saying that it is not a valid masjid because the mandir always existed and that is why it should be removed. On the other side, of course, is the Muslim side which is okay. saying that the masjid and mandir have been existing together and should be allowed to continue. We will we'll have to wait and see how this entire move is going to pan out once the courts start rehearing the matter. Back All right. You. Anisha Mathur, I'm thanking you for the moment. Of course, the case hearing resumes tomorrow. This is the Gyan Bapi Mosque case.